everybody, it's Depth 151 and welcome to the Clio Cup. As you see in the bottom right corner, it's Team Hamster Racing Battle, what goes on at the front of this. In the top left hand corner you can see the replay view, and the main screen you can see the cockpit view as we head down into the first corner at Silverstone International Circuit. It's only the short circuit, average about 50 second laps, something around that. Now, as you can see, I've got my normally Clio Cup livery on, which is a ploughman's. Uh, green and white livery. Just in front of me is a random guy which he doesn't stay there for long as at this point he cuts that little corner and gets cut corner penalty and moves out of the way nicely. Uh, just in front of me now we've got Sponge in the white car with the red and blue stripes. In front of him we have Falcon who is already looking at the car in front of him which is Hamster. So the top four are all Hamster racing and it's a battle between us lot all the way to the end the moment there's a little gap I'm just in the process of closing that up we're only on the first lap no rush yet uh, I think it was six lap race I can't remember it was an epic battle anyway all the way to the end to the line it was a battle to the very last line and there you can see a car not started it's sometimes it's sometimes it's not their fault sometimes it's to do with lagging internet connection. As we all know who won this game, glitches are rife. And they are getting sorted very slowly. We're hoping for another update sooner or later. Mad Studios, please. Or slightly Mad Studios. And uh, not to just focus on Project Cars 2 at the moment. You've already just come out with this, so let's carry on with this. As you can see, now here's a bit of controversy. Both Sponge and Falcon cut the corner. And that leaves them two struggling on a penalty diving through the middle of them both I go up into second place right behind Hamster now first place is Hamster second place is me then you've got Falcon and Sponge now you can see the gap between me and Falcon is quite big at the moment but we do close that up now I'm on the back of Hamster just biding my time closing in on the exit running a tad wide onto the grass doesn't seem to slow me down that much down into this really lovely chicane Hard on the brakes, down into about second gear, second, yeah, it's about second gear out on third. And this is another strange thing with this game, when you do the replay view, your dash doesn't change, well, everything changes, bar the gears, so. I'm trying to remember what gear I was in at the time, now I had his first go, I normally get a quick jab of the brake, just to get that front end turning, so understeer, we've been playing with the Ginetta so much, due to the championship, which the next race is at Donington Park, this weekend coming. Since we've been driving them quite a lot, we're not used to this much understeer in these little front wheel drive monsters of cars. They're really fun to drive in fun battles, and as you can see, just behind Falcon and Sponge starting to close the gap on this long back straight. Now, the width for the track really helps with the battles on this uh, circuit as well. And there may be only one racing line into the corner, but with a track this wide, you can adjust your entry for a better exit or maybe adjust your exit for a better entry? No, <laughs> no, you're adjusting your entry for a better exit so sort of taking different lines, breaking hard again into the chicane now we're all starting to close up so we've got Hamster racing in first, Hamster Junior racing in second, Hamster racing in third and Hamster Junior racing in fourth and you just saw in the background Sponge running a tad wide there onto the main straight again it's we're settled down at the moment it's it's all equals Falcon closing that gap very quickly on me though using the curb you see his car up onto two wheels in the replay view does it a few times hamster running a bit wide now Falcon really getting close to my back bumper back onto this this corner seems really tricky you could turn this corner into two corners by going wide and you're having to turn a bit l to the left as you come on the exit but you want it to carry that bit more speed as probably if you cancel a little bit of that speed out you won't having to correct yourself as much and you can see Falcon just sat there and he looks we break a bit early me and Hamster and Falcon dives down the inside a lovely little move up into second place now he'll sit on the racing line I look to the left and then to the right looking it's going to be a adventurous move breaking a bit on the grass you saw the car having a little wiggle 
trying to get a better exit out of the corner on the throttle but it doesn't seem to work as we enter the next lap Sponge just hang he's not far away but he's there to capitalise on any sort of mistake and there you go Hamster into the lead still in the lead sorry Falcon into second place and hitting them curbs again you see the car bouncing about now just tucked in behind cutting cut well not cutting all to the point of the penalty but cutting just trying to get that bit of extra speed into a corner and out of a corner and now Falcon is all over the back of Hamster just clipping the grass on the exit he's tucked right behind the slipstream Hamster moves to the right trying to get him out of the slipstream but Falcon's already got that speed there side by side into this long swooping right hander Falcon breaking that tad later but he's on the outside Hamster's got the inside but now he switches round Falcon moves to what is now the outside again for the chicane Hamster's got the inside line beautiful defensive driving breaking late it brings me into the game a little bit here so as we exit this corner this is where something weird happens this glitch has happened with Falcon before look at Hamster off to the right hits the barrier on the replay view you can see him dragging himself across the barrier now me and Falcon side by side Falcon trying to force me to the barrier trying to put me off and there you go there Hamster just appears from nowhere it puts me off I slide into Falcon Falcon now off the track and sponges right back into this Hamster leads the way he never went off the track on his screen so that little glitch there He's given Hamster the win more or less and now you can see the background Falcon and Sponge battling it out I'm still in second place just hitting them cones moving them out of the way on this long back straight as you can see Hamster with a, a decent lead due to that incident and then behind you've got me Falcon and Sponge all close together on this final lap into the long swooping right hander again just running wide both of us onto the grass and that extra bit of tarmac this gives Sponge a chance and all to close in now break your half for the chicane I'm trying to go defensive trying to keep that car in the middle of the track now Falcon cuts to the inside he's going to come down the inside on the fight call a little bit of contact there onto the last bend Falcon's on the inside he tries shoving me out and there's the contact Falcon runs off the track into the barrier I cross the line in second Falcon fourth sponge third and the winner was hamster if you've enjoyed this little race please remember to like subscribe and comment in the comment section below more coming up in these coming weeks especially with project cars with the championship on sunday the next round round two of the championship for the Ginetta gt4s at donington park and also the formula one game coming out on friday we'll be taking a good look at that we'll we'll definitely get a video out on friday for that uh, if you've enjoyed, remember to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.